um, Flash ID. And I just explained uh, production and the classes of production. Now, for production to be complete, you need land, labor, capital, and enterprise. Now, these are the factors of production. Now, what, does, what is the meaning of land and how does it affect production? What is labor and how does it affect production? What is capital and enterprise or entrepreneurship? Now, land. Land is the surface on which to produce. Surface on which to produce. And land doesn't always mean a uh, land area. For example, the sun, rain, fishes on the sea, they are also regarded as land. Because land are free gift of nature for production. So they are the gift of nature or natural resources that enhance production. So the surface on which to produce is land. And land is fixed and also immobile. You can't move land. Land is the surface on which to produce. And the reward for land, land is rent. Because you can't take land. So what you pay landowners for the use of land is rent. That's the reward for land. Why labor is the effort put into production, ski or, or effort. So you employ labor for production. So labor can be skilled or unskilled labor. So all this effort you put towards production, like hiring people and all those efforts, any effort or ski that is put in production to be complete is labor. And the reward for labor is wages. Wages or salary. When you hire laborers, to partake in production process. So you have to pay them, and that's wages and salary. That's the reward for labor. And unlike land, labor is mobile. So you can move laborers from one place to another, or you can even change from one ski to another. So in that case, you are moving labor. So labor is another important factor of what? Production. Now, while you are employing labor, or you are paying for laborers, you are not buying the laborer. We are paying for their service. And the third one is capital. Capital. Capital is man-made. Yes, it's man-made input in production. So it is with the uh, fund, assets, or cash in production. So money that is spent on production, all your machineries, tractors, cranes, so any machine employed in production, they are under capital, they are assets, and the money you pump into production is assets. So both of them are man-made in production. So the last one is, uh, the reward for capital is interest. So you pay interest for the use of capital. And one thing about capital is that it is subject to diminishing return. The more you use uh, assets, the more their value drop, even machines and even cash. Money has value. There's something called time value of money. That's one of the reasons you even pay interest or depreciation rates on capital. With time, the value begins to drop. The efficiency of machines to reduce. So, uh, that is it. The entrepreneur or the enterprise, uh, they are those that put... They organize other factors of production. They organize or coordinate other factors of production to make sure that production is successful. So the entrepreneur or uh, the enterprise uh, brings land, make sure land is available, make sure labor is available, provides capital. So it coordinates all these things and run errand to make sure that all these factors are put together for production to be possible. So these are the factors of production and they are rewards. So the reward for Entrepreneurship is profit. So the entrepreneur makes profit. Thanks for watching. And if you like this video, why not subscribe to this channel to get similar videos? Yeah, do. Thank you very much.